can literally see your dumb head thinking of something to say. I watch your face then go, oh, I've thought of a dumb thing to do. What am I trying to do? Impress people. That's true, but also I'm trying to catch the wind. <laughs> no, not very good. <laughs> good morning, party people. <laughs> Welcome to the breakdown. As I was sitting on the camera, I literally yeah. watched your face go. <laughs> like, oh. If I read a title that's like semi easy for me to come up with a dumb thing to do, I just get too excited. I'm like, please don't screw this up. Today we're checking out being as an ocean's brand new track, Catch the Wind. It's you actually no it. wind either, so I'm just kind of catching the air. And you're not catching anything, you use a dramatic hug. <laughs> <laughs> we love being as an ocean. Uh, we do. They haven't released anything in a little while, so I'm excited to hear this. Yeah, they're a great band. We do love them. A band that has gone through quite a few cool changes and a really different sound to when they first started. So it'll be yeah, interesting sure. to see where they're going now. So let's get into it. Have you liked and subscribed? Ooh, aggressive. Thank you. All right, three, two, one. Somba. Sorry for the early pause, but as I just melt into my seat a little bit, this is this dude, the clean vocalist, has one of my favorite clean vocals out of any band. Yeah, we, just, we discussed this when we first heard them. We were like, his voice is so good. It must be like edited or something there. And then we saw him live. Yeah. It's just like, oh. And it's just mind-blowingly smooth. Yeah. Like butter, baby. <laughs> One thing this band has always been good at, and it's hugely like attributed to his vocal style and delivery, is the juxtaposition of his really emotional, heartfelt, aggressive, screamy sing over some really nice melodic music. Yeah, they do it so well. Music, it's beautiful. You can't pause this for two minutes now. Okay. We're a minute, and you've already paused it twice. That is That's true. Vito on John pausing. <laughs> different with his vocals it sounds like there's a slight something in the production in like his a vocals. distortion ever so slightly it has almost like an echo which i feel like almost takes away from it for me personally as you said his vocals are so raw and so like passionate when there's like a slight 
filter and edit over it, it, it takes away from that a little bit for me. Okay, I didn't really Normally, get that. Normally, I right? understand every word so clearly. And yeah. I think there's a few words there I was like, hmm, I didn't get that one. Because it sounded like there was like a slight echo or slight distortion on it. It's definitely layered um, because he's throwing in those sort of deeper screams that he Behind hasn't done it. for a while. I really like them. They're not even yeah. the parts that I'm not getting. It's actually the... I think it adds well for that, yeah. but not for the rest of it. Okay, I'll have to pay a bit more attention. Since far away, I just know that someone somewhere has felt your pain. Um, Great statement. I really like that song. I love the song. The heavy, heavy vocals juxtaposed over his beautiful vocals. Yeah. At the end there. Perfect. So good. Yeah. There is, as I said, somewhere in there where they've laid his vocals, it just took away from it a little bit from what I knew from him. And maybe that's because I didn't expect it. But my thing with his vocals, I don't know his name. Um, is that because it is just so raw and emotional but you can still fully understand and grasp everything he's saying and yeah. I didn't get the lyrics of that song as much as I normally would with his parts I definitely when it kicked into that bit because I obviously didn't notice it too much in the first two verses but when it kicked in after that I paid a little bit more attention and I do get what you're saying I, and, I was, did, and by I that stage yeah, they also didn't do the just him over the clock music as much so it's yeah, harder to catch yeah. but I think I do think part of it has to do with the layers I think maybe they may have overdone the layers in those little bits just a little bit and it does sort of thicken it up and take away from you know the clarity and the diction yeah, and stuff which but, works really well when he's doing that big heavy simple lines when there's him consistently singing whatever he's singing I just didn't get that as much but that is yeah. the only thing in the song that I didn't love and I still enjoyed listening to it. Yeah, absolutely. I'm, I'm loving the fact that we're hearing him do some of those bigger, deeper sort of screams again. He hasn't mm. done those for a couple of albums. Um, the music was quite, quite simple, but yeah. the thing with this sort of music is if you're going to have a really sort of emotive um, song and you want people to sort of just sort of float away with the song and drift off and enjoy the moment, you just need a really good sense of melody. Yeah, and you that's don't what need a have. breakdown. You don't need big You don't need moments. fancy guitar riffs. It's just a really good sense of melody, some really clever chord progressions, just real nice tones. Um, the clean vocalist and guitarist's vocals are just so beautiful. Yeah. They're so nice. I thought the film clip was really cool too. It matched yeah. the vibe super well. Uh, Reminded me of the Twilight. Ooh. Just being in the forest and that... Yeah. I know that's such a like minute part of both of it, but just I kept getting that vibe. And then when there was the lights in the forest, when he's like walking through, that kind of reminded me of something like magical. And I don't see, know. we're so different because the bit where they were walking up through the the woods reminded me of like Vikings or something. <laughs> There's just a scene I remember from like the second season of Vikings where they're all walking up a hill that looked like that. So there we go. Different strokes for different folks. <laughs> all in all, I thought that was sick. Hope that's the start of something bigger. 
potentially a new album, that'd be very exciting. That would be great. Hey, um, if you guys haven't already liked and subscribed, like Nathan mentioned earlier, could you please do that? That'd be great. We love it. Share you it sound around. desperate. You, honestly, you sound desperate. Please, love me. Please, for God's sake, Show someone me love something. me. Give me some attention. We'll see you guys next time.